Hey guys, Chris here, 8280 Creative. Um, I am responding to an email or to a, a post that was a question that was asked on Facebook about um, aligning multiple color screens to get the, the print correct. Um, one simple, simple thing uh, that you need to learn is to use registration marks on your artwork. And what that is, I'm, I printed out a sample here. Um, this, this is actually for a, an 11 by 17 inch print, but um, I printed out an, an eight and a half by 11. But you see these little marks right here? What you're looking at is two transparencies. See that? One is for the, for the white, that's gonna go down on the black shirt. And one is the red that's going to go over the black, over the white, so that it's nice and bright. Um, what I did, or what you do, is is you use these registration marks here. You see these little crosshairs. You just make yourself a little crosshair when you print out um, these transparencies, so that the crosshairs are located where that it is located on the same same exact spot on each transparency. And the reason for that is when you go and you burn a white screen let's just say because we're looking at this one um, these transparency marks are going to show up and you want them to show up because when you go and burn a red screen the transparency marks are on the exact same location you see that so what happens is once this let's just say this is a burnt screen and you printed this already on a piece of fabric or something just to test out and your screens locked in place and ready to go then you bring over your your red screen and you bring this on top of the print that's already there and basically you, you align the screen with the registration marks that you already printed from the white, uh, from the white uh, screen. And once those registration marks look aligned and they look perfect, you go ahead and you lock your screen into place and you give it a swipe. And if the print looks right, well then you got it. You know, there's, there's nothing else to do. Um, then you just repeat this process with every color that you have and you should be good to go the the key thing is to make sure that those registration marks are in the exact same location on every single transparency now in illustrator you do that um i mean i use illustrator for all my screen printing stuff but in illustrator you create you know your, your different layers okay your different layers and your different screens so one layer is blue you know one layer is your white white screen one layer is your red screen one layer is your so on and so forth well you have an extra layer that is always visible showing the registration marks. So every time you print a white screen, a white transparency, or a black, or a red, or whatever, um, those transparency or those uh, excuse me, those registration marks are on the same exact location on all those transparencies. See what I mean? So I hope that helped. Uh, any questions? Give me a call for zero two two six eight zero nine eight or uh, eighty two eighty com, Facebook, whatever, uh, YouTube, and I'll be doing another video here in a minute for somebody who asked about. Um, should I invest in a silk screen machine? Uh, should I invest in heat transfers? You know, low money, that sort of thing. Uh, we'll see you next time.